Hi, thanks for joining me on my next video. I just bought this product, it's called Guard Z, and it's supposed to help with uh, problem surfaces, specifically for sealing them. What I've got here is uh, some damage that was done to the drywall when I started to remove part of the crown molding. And as you can see, the paper is exposed, and in some areas, there's actually the chipboard behind the paper that's exposed. So if you try to just uh, mud that, what's going to happen is the paper is going to get wet. It's just going to bubble up and it's never going to stick. So by using this product, it's supposed to seal it and then allow me to mud it without uh, any issues. So what I've done so far is I started sealing it and I'm going to seal the entire area. And then I'm going to put a coat of mud on and see how that uh, stays on. It says to uh, wait about three hours before you uh, apply mud. So what I'm going to do is uh, wait three hours and then apply the mud and I'll continue videoing. So I'm just going to demonstrate how I apply it. They say you can use a little mini roller or brush. I choose to use a brush. And basically just sweat my brush and just get it in there. Make sure that I seal everything up nicely. So that's how I apply it. I'm going to wait about three hours like they recommend before I put any mud on this. So I'm back now after waiting about a few days. I didn't get a chance to get back to it earlier. So after applying the Guard Z, this is what it looks like. And to the touch, it feels kind of rough. So what I'm going to do is apply the mud on it and see how well that sticks and hopefully it doesn't bubble up. Seems to be sticking on nicely. I don't see any uh, bubbling happening. I'll try some on the roof here on the ceiling see how that goes. Seems to be sticking nicely. So it is uh, working as uh, advertised and uh, so far I'm quite happy with it. So I'll see how it goes after the mud dries and how easy it is uh, in terms of sanding and making sure that uh, nothing comes through back to the paper. I'll keep you posted here. Here's another view of the first uh, coat of mud on top of the Guard Z product. I did both the the wall and the ceiling, so that's the first coat. Doesn't look bad at all in terms of uh, adhesion to the drywall, and uh, doesn't appear to be any bubbling, which is really good. So, as I mentioned, I think uh, I'm quite happy with this product. It does do what it says it's supposed to do, and. Uh, I definitely would recommend it if you're doing this kind of repair work on your ceiling or drywall walls or whatever. So this is what it dried like after applying my first coat of mud on top of the drywall that I prepared with the Guard Z product. I hope that's how you pronounce it. And I'm now applying my second coat, as you can see, which will be my final coat. This is going to be covered anyway, so I'm not too concerned. But I did want to try out the Guard Z product to see how it actually works. And I'm quite happy with it. And uh, didn't see any bubbling when I was applying my mud yesterday. And uh, seems to be doing the trick in terms of sealing the drywall tape. So I'm quite happy with it. Thanks for joining me on this video. And please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.